are you from? Well, hello to you. I'm Merrill Pepcorn, and I'm from Fargo, North Dakota, and I am the Secret Viking. And for asking me where I'm from and greeting me in such a friendly manner, I'm going to give you a dollar. Okay, I'm not the real Secret Viking. <laughs> if you asked the real Secret Viking that question, you would get a hundred dollars. But I've never been the real Secret Viking, so I'm just the self-appointed uh, pretend Secret Viking. And because I want people to like me, if they ask me where I'm from and say hello, I just give them a dollar. So here's your dollar. Thank you very Great, much. Great, thanks. That's a gem. All right. So what are you doing here at Husfest? I have several roles here at Hustfest this year in particular. I first started coming to Hustfest about six years ago to do my daily Prairie Public Radio talk show live from Hustfest from three to four. Did a couple of days, usually a Wednesday and a Thursday from Hustfest. The name of that show is here and now. So that was the start of it. And I still am doing that, as a matter of fact. At least one day during the run of Hustfest, I broadcast my show here at now, live from Hustfest, from the Touchstone Energy booth, as a matter of fact. Right in front of Copenhagen Hall. It's very nice. They have a nice radio broadcast facility there. Got it all set up. They line up guests for you and everything. So it's a lot of fun. We've been doing that for about six years. And then three years ago, my band, the Radio Stars, started playing here. And so we're back for our third year. We are in Copenhagen Hall this year, playing at 8.30 a.m. and 2.30 p.m. And in addition to that, just one more thing, we call it the Pepcorn Pile-On. As long as you're here, why not pile on as many activities as possible? So one other thing we're doing this year is that Friday night of Hustfest, we are presenting Dakota Air, the radio show. That's our live, old-fashioned radio variety show with comedy, music, original skits, and humor. And we are performing a special edition of Dakota Air, the radio show, Friday night, about 8.30, to benefit Minot Area Flood Relief. And so we're looking forward to that as well. Now, what are some of your favorite things about Hustfest? Oh my gosh, it's, uh, you, you hear everybody say this, but it's the people. The friendships that are forged over the years. Now, you're saying, okay, well, I'm a first-time Hustfester. I don't know anybody at Hustfest. Well, don't worry about that. You're going to meet a lot of people here. Uh, who you will enjoy. and You'll probably see somebody you know here. There will probably be somebody from your hometown here or maybe somebody you went to school with, no matter where you're from. Uh, just meeting people from all over the country. Uh, you should be a social-oriented person in order uh, to really enjoy Hustfest because a lot of it is about visiting. Now, that said, for the price of admission, once you get inside, there's a lot of great entertainment that comes with the price of that ticket. For example, and I enjoy all of these people, Bjorn Holland, the great singer from Norway, Williams and Reed, who I think are a couple of the funniest guys uh, I've ever just sat and listened to. I can sit down and listen to their show every time and just laugh. And uh, the other free stage entertainment, that's a real plus, I think, in addition, of course, to the great food. Yeah. Any favorite food items that you'd like to recommend? Well, I am partial to the the waffles with whipped cream and strawberries. I like that. And also, I like to just get a cup of coffee and a piece of Lefsa off the Lefsa cart. That's kind of my alley. And I will occasionally treat myself to a lutefisk and meatball dinner. I don't have lutefisk often, but it's twice a year, uh, Christmas Eve and at Hustfest. So I will usually take in a, a, a Hustfest lutefisk dinner while I'm here. Well, Merle, we wish you a really great Hustfest, and thanks for visiting with us. Well, it's a lot of fun, and I encourage everybody just to come to Hustfest. If you've never been here, just come and experience it once so that you can say, I've been to Hustfest.